Craig, everybody. Thanks for stopping in. Tonight, I'm going to be cooking up some steak bites with asparagus. Basically, we're going to take our favorite steak, cut it up into bite-sized pieces, mix it with some crisp, fresh asparagus. It's nutritious, packed with protein, low on carbs, high in fiber, real easy to do, so let's get started. Now, in a skillet over medium heat, just add some extra virgin olive oil, and we want to saute some onions. You can use any type of onion you want. I'm just using sweet onion tonight. Throw in a little salt to help that sweating process. Then we'll start on our steak while our onions are cooking. Now I've got some room temperature ribeye here. You can uh, use any type of lean cut that you want, but basically you just want to cut your meat up into bite-sized pieces. Season it with some kosher salt and some coarse black pepper. Give it a toss to make sure all your steak bites are well coated with your seasonings. Once your onions are almost done, just push them aside, add a little bit more oil to your skillet, up your heat to medium high, then add your steak bites. Now we want to sear these steak bites, so for that first couple of minutes, try not to touch it because we want to get a good sear on that one side. And after a couple of minutes, you can see how well it's cooking. It's going to go fast because you've cut your meat up into bite-sized pieces so it doesn't take long. The only thing to do is just enjoy that smell and listen to that sizzle. Next, we want to add our veggies. Now, I've taken some of the fresh asparagus, cut off the tips, washed them, dried them really well, and just mix it with your meat. Give it a little bit more oil, and it's only going to take about five minutes. Be sure to scrape up all those great brown bits at the bottom of your skillet that's just going to add to the flavor of your dish. Throw in a couple of pats of butter for a little richness. Once your butter melts, guys, bowl it up. Like I said, this is a nutritious meal. It doesn't take long. You can have it done in about 15 minutes, and it's so very tasty. So if you're looking for a different way to cook up some beef and get in your veggies at the same time, give this a try. I think you'll like it. But if you like this video, like, subscribe, comment, let me know what you think. I really appreciate it. And until next time, guys, I'll see you later. Enjoy. Bye-bye, y'all.